Hi Aries, it's Ellie. Welcome to my channel and we're doing your reading. So let's begin. I've already cleansed this space and I've meditated on your cards. This reading is good for your sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs. If this reading resonates for you, please give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below how it resonated for you. All right. I hear worth the way. Worth the wait. Yeah. I see someone opening like a can of peaches. Like a can of peaches. Maybe you're opening a can of peaches. I don't know. All right. You have the Three of Swords as your overall energy, Aries. You have the Page of Pentacles, the Nine of Pentacles, and then the Queen of Swords. Very discerning. Very discerning during this time. You have the Hermit, the Temperance card, and then the death card. Okay. Okay. All right. I get it. You are waiting. You're just sitting there and waiting very patiently. And you understand that whoever it is that's meant to be for you, whoever is meant for you will never pass you by. You know that. So you're just going to sit there. You're just going to wait for the right person to come towards you. Don't get me wrong, Aries. You're a a gorgeous gorgeous sign everybody a lot of people are attracted to you all right the three of swords as your overall energy aries you're getting out of heartbreak it has been a while since you've really opened yourself up to the world up you've opened since you've opened yourself up basically um I'm getting lessons learned. Lessons learned. All right? And you've learned the lesson of whatever it is that caused the, the pain, the heartbreak in the past. You understand that things that you needed to grow from. That's the reason why we go through such lessons. Because there are, small, there are certain triggers in, in us, all right, that we really need to understand. That we really haven't healed yet. And they come up. They come up because those parts of us have not healed yet. So you've healed that part of you. Whatever it is, you know more than I do, but you've healed. And completely, completely healed, all right? You have the Page of Pentacles to the Hermit card. Someone, all right, you could be dealing with a Virgo, but someone is very interested in you. They want to date you. They want to ask you out. Um... They want to shower you with gifts if possible, all right? But they feel that you're very shut shut off, all right? Uh, you're very closed off to the world. Yes, as I said earlier, you're just about to come out of that shell. Um, people have tried to come towards you in the past, but you know that it's not yet your time because you're trying to heal from whatever it was that really hurt you in the past. But now you're coming out coming out someone wants to date you they're just trying to wait for you to open up a little they're trying to wait you have the nine of pentacles to the temperance card i'm getting you want to be single until the right person comes in you're very independent you're self-sufficient your money is on point all right, but very solitary energy still. Nines are about solitary energies. But more so, it's because you know that the right person will come to you. You don't need to chase it. You don't need to look for it. It's just going to come. When the timing is right, when the universe thinks you're ready, they will come in. And you know that. You're very sure of it, which is really good. Don't doubt it. Do not doubt it. All right? 
You have the Queen of Swords to the Death card. You're very discerning. You know. You know more. All right? There are stages in the tarot in the tarot deck. The queens are stages. All right? Um the Queen of Wands is about is the young queen, all right? The young queen, someone's very driven, someone who's ambitious, all right? The Queen of Cups is the one who practices self-love, gives a lot of love, self-care. The Queen of Pentacles is the independent queen, all right? And then the Queen of Swords is the most discerning queen. So she is a queen that has been through many, all right? Through a lot. And I'm getting you know now you know better all right you're following your head over your heart you've transformed really although it was painful at first it was a beautiful transformation whatever it is whatever it was that you went through in the past you've transformed into something much much more beautiful aries and I love it about you. What is the overall outcome? All right. You have the Four of Pentacles. All right. Okay. Two of Pentacles, Five of Swords. I'm still getting a lot of waiting energy. And you're fine. You're fine to wait. You have the Four of Pentacles, the Two of Pentacles, and then the Five of Swords. Better to wait for the right one than to be juggled for you. I do see you being a little bit negative about the people coming towards you because... Not really negative, but again, discerning. Very, very much discerning. You're really assessing whether or not the person that's coming towards you is has good intentions. If they're not going to juggle you or anything. But I'm getting your taking things lightly. It won't be easy to get in. It won't be easy to get in. You'll be open to to getting to know people. I'm seeing you do that. But it takes a lot more to really get to know you. To really get into that heart space of yours. Alright, what is the advice for you? Three of Wands, the Strength card, and then the Knight of Wands. Okay. Three of Wands, expand your horizons. Travel if you need to. Same with the Knight of Wands. Travel if you need to. Set goals, all right? Set goals. And then the Strength card. Hang on. All right, hang on. Okay, let's see. Other messages for you. soulmate you have soulmate yes this is your soulmate you're waiting for the right person all right and then make the effort great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take okay you have focus there's a need for focus And then flow. All right. So yes, that is all I have for you, Aries. I hope something in this reading resonated. If it did, please do give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below how it resonated for you. I love you all so much. I'll see you in the next reading and stay blessed.